We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number five. You can be anything you want to be. The heartwarming true story of a mother's love and determination that inspired an ordinary boy. You weren't meant to be a failure, Benny. To reach extraordinary heights. You did very well, Dr. Carson. But you came through just fine. Thank you. Academy Award winner Cuba Gooding Jr. and Kimberly Elise. Gifted Hands, The Ben Carson Story. Number four. When you say people, you mean living people? You do want the job, don't you? Hi. I'm Dr. Thayer. I'm Wahida. Wahida. I'd like to ask. I was born in 1911 in Kingsbridge, New York. Prior to July 1955, I resided the Brooklyn Psychiatric Center, Brooklyn, New York. How are you today? I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> I was a person! <laughs> it gets easier. You don't think it will, but it does. Can you hear me? Does he ever speak to you? Of course not. Not in words. No change in data 9-11-44. Your patients, doctor, haven't moved in decades. What I believe, what I know, these people are alive inside. Well, how do you know that, Doctor? I know it. I just wanted to say to you, I preferred your explanation. At 200 milligrams, he showed no response. Maybe he needs more. Maybe he needs less. Dr. Thayer, it's a miracle. Where are my glasses? They're on your face. that I could deal with losing 30 years of my life, could you? Have you thought what you'd like to do today? Everything. Leonard, where are you going? I would do all the things that you people take for granted. I'd go for a walk. I'd look at things. I'd talk to people. You work here? No, I live here. You don't look like a patient. <laughs> Hello? Girls. You're not married. Me? Would you like to go out for a cup of coffee? I need a medical officer. Are you a nurse? Yes. Then help me. You know, you often look at me as though you knew me. I have seen you. Yuri, there's an extraordinary girl. I know, I'm not dancing with you. What happens to a girl like that when a man like you has finished with her? I give it to you. If only there was someone to look after you. Of course, if there were, I'd be destroyed by Jess. Don't. We've not done anything you'll have to lie about. Goodbye, Zhivago. This is an awful time to be alive. No, no. What are we going to do? I don't know. Wouldn't it have been lovely if we'd met before? I think we may go mad if we think about all that. I shall always think about it. Number two. Morning. Why would a doctor want to hire a cop? 
This is where my work is done. What is your work? Medical research. Let me see those hands. You must have got it. Oh, Vivian! He's working at a hospital, right? Yeah, yeah. Everyone's gonna see how smart you are. Vivian, Dr. Blaylock wanted you to have this. Excuse me, all workers punch in at the rear entrance. He's with me. Well, I'm sorry, Dr. Blaylock, but that's the rules. You gotta blow her face. She's I don't think that she's blue. breathing I right now. I don't, I don't think that she's breathing. That baby back there, how long? Six months. Are you going to take this on, doctor? No one's ever done anything as hard as this. You can't operate on the heart. That's basic. There must be a way to get more blood to the lungs. If we focus on the pulmonary artery. Oh, on this God's earth, are you? You got that white coat. You're just a class three work the same as me. I'd like some coffee and a donut. What about you going to medical school? You don't have to remind me of that, Clara. We have a family now. Let's start with experiments. Let's break their rules. You can begin the incision. I'm not ready for that. If I say you're ready, you're ready. You have to see this. Vivian Thomas is operating, assisted by the chief of surgery. Retract it. No sushi. Can't we try things my way occasionally? I think we've found a way to repair your daughter's heart. Your quest for glory is vain. Postpone the operation until you have more experience. Postponing means signing that baby's death warrant. I'm operating tomorrow. Hey, Vivian Thomas. What's wrong? What's happening? Paging Vivian Thomas. Running in OR right now. You're talking me through this. Scrub up. What's he doing here? You can resume your duties. These are his duties. We made history together. We changed the world. Number one. Life is full of surprises. Ladies and gentlemen, the terrible. Elephant. Man. At first, you will want to turn away from him. Then, you may find him a silent, unresisting target for your ridicule. Stand up. Stand up. Turn around. Mister, why is your head so big, mister? <laughs> but if you come to know him... Have you always been the way you are now? You will begin to see beyond the perversion of his form. Are you in any pain? Are your parents still alive? Your father? Your mother? And discover the beauty in the beast. He is English. He is 21. His name is John Merrick. At no time have I met with such a perverted or degraded version of a human being as this man. Am I to assume then that he is ultimately incurable? Yes, sir. This hospital doesn't accept incurables. The freak hunting. This is monstrous. If you ask my opinion, he's only being stared at all over again. People pay money to see your monster, Mr. Treves. I'll collect it. Yada, monster, yada. Freak. What was it all for? Why did I do it? And perhaps for the first time, you will understand the true meaning of courage and human dignity. I... I'm not an animal. I am a human being. You're not an elephant man at all. You're Romeo. Anthony Hopkins. Anne Bancroft. Sir John Gielgud. Wendy Hiller. And John Hurt as the Elephant Man. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. And for more top five movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.